demonstrate the microteter technique, we will be using one positive and one negative sample. We identify the wells that will be used for each sample. One drop of cells from the first sample is put into the correct well. This is repeated for the second sample. One drop of Lorn reagent is then added to both wells. The microteter plate is then agitated according to the instructions for use. The results can then be examined. The microteter plate is tapped in order to agitate the contents of the wells. Despite gentle shaking, a positive sample remains agglutinated, whilst the negative sample disperses back into suspension. 